there there was a case of a woman i think teaching on some university that uh that got excommunicated because she encouraged people to pray to heavenly mother uh mm -hmm. what do you think about that that idea I think maybe you're talking about Margaret Toscano. Uh -huh. Um, and yeah, I mean, I think, I, I don't think the church should take a very, like a punitive role in policing how other people connect to God. Mm -hmm. Um, I also think that this is going to be one of those things that once women have the priesthood and are at the highest levels of the church, the doctrine of he heavenly mother will, will be more fully elucidated um, and talked about. Mm -hmm. And so we'll figure out a lot more about her and we'll be able to talk about her more once women, I think, are uh, fully integrated into the leadership structure. Um, so, yeah, I don't think it's bad. I definitely don't think it's bad. Mm -hmm. um, do, do you I think... personally pray sometimes or have you prayed to Heavenly Mother? I don't, but I think that's a lot of because of the way I was socialized uh -huh. um, and raised as a Mormon person. That's why I think once women become leaders and like it becomes more integrated into practice, uh, it will make sense to a lot more people. I mean, I personally don't, but that's because I was raised yeah. 